Battling the heat, competitors cycled, swam, and ran their way to the finish line in Brandon Sunday morning. Both of you are able to hold off this heat. It's starting to get hot, even hotter as the sun comes up. The runners, so, yeah, yeah. It's, uh, I don't know how he does it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know either. The first place relay team, bike crossing fleet feet, were among the men and women competing in memory of Ryan LaSource, who died of leukemia at just three years old. While proceeds from the race go to fighting childhood cancer, participants fought their way through the 70.3 mile course, either as individuals or in a relay group. This is a, a very big, uh, endurance endeavor. So people are, are training for this event for six months, getting ready for this event. And uh, it's a huge, huge effort. This is the fourth year of the Ryan Man Triathlon and organizers say this race has raised over $80,000 for Baptist Children's Hospital. I want you to get at the invest rather than go somewhere else. I want you to stay in Mississippi. Local competitors going the extra mile, literally for local children. And Brandon, Earl Arms, 16 WAPT News. Our own David Harbin and his daughters Allison and Audrey taking part in the race as well. Medals were given to the top five finishers for each division based on gender and age.